Hi, I'm Mike McNamara with the McNamaraReport.com. If you're shopping for a projector for use in your office or on the road, the most important features to look for are image quality, easy setup and controls, and portability. But with the confusing specs, how can you tell which projector has the best combination of features and price for your needs? To find out, I tested two similar price projectors from Epson and BenQ and discovered dramatic differences between the two. The proof is in the projection, so let's take a closer look. For starters, the Epson EX5200 is smaller and lighter than the BenQ MP522, and the Epson comes with a carrying case, advanced remote control, and a sliding lens cap that puts it into sleep mode. The Epson also has a wider variety of connection options. On the other hand, the BenQ has two built-in fans that are slightly quieter than the single Epson fan. When connecting to a laptop, your only choice with the BenQ is the traditional VGA connector, which can be a real challenge, even for experienced users. You have to press projector keys and several computer function keys to mirror the computer display to the projection screen. Epson's USB plug-and-play feature for PCs and Macs automatically syncs the projector to the computer and mirrors the display for you, all within seconds. Keystone correction is needed to properly align the screen image when the projector is raised to an angle during setup. Epson's automatic keystone correction requires no effort and takes just a few seconds. The BenQ requires pushing menu buttons on the remote or projector, which can be confusing and time-consuming. Image quality is a top concern for most users, and color, brightness, and resolution are the most important image quality factors. Both projectors have XGA resolution, but Epson's 3LCD, 3-chip engine, and lens produce a slightly more detail and higher image quality compared to BenQ's single-chip DLP engine and lens. Note the Epson's brighter, more saturated colors, especially evident in the yellows and reds. Two measurements can help determine best image quality, white light output and color light output. Epson's perceived higher brightness is confirmed by its test results for ISO standard white light output. In addition, Epson's color light output, based on a proposed ISO standard, is rated at more than twice as high as the BenQ. So the Epson delivers both high brightness and high color accuracy at the same time. Now let's take a look at special features. Additional connectors on the Epson let you use it without a computer. The HDMI port allows you to connect DVD and Blu-ray players, plus new digital cameras and camcorders. Sound can also be played through the Epson speakers using a single HDMI cord. With Epson's PC-free connector, you can view pictures or run a presentation using a USB thumb drive or other USB device. You can even zoom into images using the remote control. Projector lenses also make a difference. At the same distance from the screen, the Epson projects a larger image than the BenQ MP522, and when you zoom to resize the BenQ, you have to manually refocus. For about $100 more, BenQ sells the MP522 ST model with a slightly larger image close to the screen, but it doesn't have a zoom lens, and moving the Epson back a short distance achieves the same result. So there you have it. The proof is in the projection. And in this case, the Epson EX5200 delivers far more for the money and exhibits the higher image quality found in most 3LCD projectors versus single-chip DLP projectors. For more information on these projectors, visit the McNamareReport.com. And thanks for tuning in.